This question asks us to prove a result that if we do this fraction, take away this fraction, the answer is 2 minus 8n all over n, n minus 2. So we work out what happens if we work out that, take away that. So I write out the first fraction with a slight gap, take away the second fraction. I then place brackets around that, because it's two terms. I leave the n as it is, a bracket here, and a bracket here. Now to subtract all that fractions, I need the same denominator. This has got an n, this has got a bracket n minus 2, close bracket. So, I times the top and bottom of the first fraction by n minus 2. I then times the top and bottom of this fraction by the n. They both now have n bracket n minus 2 in the denominator. I then expand the numerator. So 3n times n is 3n squared. Minus n minus 6n is minus 7n. And minus 1 times minus 2 is plus 2. Take away this one here. n times 3n is 3n squared, and n times 1 is n. Right then, 3n squared take away 3n squared. They cancel off. A minus 7n take away an n is minus 8n. A 2 take away nothing, that's just 2. All over the bottom, which is n, n minus 2, which is as required, 2 minus 8n all over n, n minus 2. Proven.